Ima for the uh, Halloween candy and snacks. I like snacks. Thank you. So the project at hand today is, the first project is dealing with these windows. I keep them very clean on the inside, but you can see on the outside of them is dirty. Uh, I think I know a way we can fix that, so I want to try and clean the outside of these. to have this little bit of fire escape my little private backyard in the middle of New York City Certainly, I mean, it's not perfect. There's still little spots here and there if I want to be really particular with it, but definitely, definitely an improvement from how it was before. what this is but I just found a bunch of motorcycles under the exit to the Queensboro Bridge. If anybody knows what's going on with this let me know because they're cool bikes.
So it's getting closer to winter now. It's been 50 degrees in the mornings when I leave for work, even in like the lowest 60 some days all day. So that's why I'm looking for some more winter stuff. I make a deal with myself though. Anytime I ever get new clothing, I decide for each new thing I get, one to two things that I have now that I don't wear, I get rid of. Either of those things will just get donated or I can try and sell it. Well, I've put together a bag that I've had forever now. Actually, it's been months I've had this bag. It's been months I've had this bag together of clothes that I've earmarked to sell or donate, done nothing with it. I'm gonna try to conquer some of that today. Sorted. For instance, these are nice pants. I picked up at Goodwill months and months ago. They don't fit. So these will go in the cell pile. Actually, so I've spoken about my love for really well-made things. One of the things that I love, I will never get rid of, is these boots here. Ridiculously well-made, classic. And I got those cheap. These I got actually off an online shop and imported them from Japan. So <laughs> they're cool. But they're really expensive and honestly not that comfortable. But I like them though. I'm gonna vote and hold on to them for now. Give it like a month. And if I don't wear them at all within the month, then they'll go. Because that's one of my issues. I get rid of things, like on a whim, and then regret getting rid of it, and purchasing something similar again. Like recently, I've been wanting to get back into biking. That if I were to get back into biking, I gotta replace like all of my biking shit. And that's gonna be expensive, but best part of having the nice job now is I can afford to do this kind of shit. I gotta keep that in mind. It's too late to do anything with this stuff today, but I've got stuff to sell, stuff to donate. So now that's done, that's sorted. Whenever I get some time earlier in the day, well, one of these days that can go get sold, donated, gotten rid of. Oh, come on. The person you're trying to reach is not available. Hi there. Hi, Kira. How's it going? Good. Thank you for the Halloween snacks. I appreciate it. Oh, you're welcome. I'm glad I finally got there.
All right, so boom, I'm at work right now. I quite a little bit of an issue. One, I got my shoes falling apart. And two, I got a hole in my pocket. So a little bit of a minor setback. Let's get these fixed. So that is my work pants fixed, but my work shoes not fixed. Uh, ran out of glue, thought I had more up in the closet, I don't. They've been working like that fine. I haven't even noticed they came apart until now, so I think they'll be fine. And if not, I do have hiking boots I can wear just not technically approved for work so there's always that a bigger deal is this though can i a bigger deal is this 5 32 p.m and it's getting dark out look how clean i think that was still the best move i could have done clean that clean that super nice I've been working on this video for maybe like a week, week and a half in my free time when I have time to do like one project. Now it's gotten to the point where I have a day off tomorrow. So I'm going to spend my day off doing a day trip, going upstate to go visit my mom, my sister, see some friends, and I have an appointment. So I'm kind of just making a day out of it. I've enjoyed filming while I've been home. 
Um, I might film a little bit while I go on the state trip upstate, but I also kind of want to just spend the time with people not worrying about shoving a camera in the face. So we'll see. I'll at least film my trip going up there because it's the fall. It should look kind of pretty, but I'm not really sure exactly how much I'll film. So I guess you'll know when you see it or don't see it. Thank <laughs> you.